Now let's build an enormously big wind damper on the top of the building. Pull the handle to hoist the iron ball. Tighten the screw to fix the iron ball in place. Now, install the small damper to connect the iron ball to the foundation. Spin the wrench to fix the screw. The iron ball of the wind damper is very big and heavy. It is as heavy as 132 elephants. Fix it in place on the top of the skyscraper. During a typhoon or an earthquake, it will swing from side to side so that the skyscraper is sturdier and does not shake. Wow, the skyscraper looks so grand! Buildings with shake reduction measures and buildings without shake reduction measures will act differently in an earthquake. Slide the button to check it out. Small earthquake. Stay intact in a small earthquake. Medium earthquake. Repairable damages in medium earthquake. Big earthquake. Won't collapse in a big earthquake. Great job! Wow! The earthquake resistant building you built is so sturdy! Amazing! Keep going! Factory building. Do you know where it's safer to build a house? Is it on the seismic faults? Or is it on flat ground? That's right! Houses that are built on the seismic faults may collapse when an earthquake strikes. Houses should be built at a safe location. 